Welcome to Autobike Focus, your go-to source for deep dives into the world's most exciting machines on land, sea, and sky. Today, we take a closer look at a fighter jet that has captured global attention, the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41. Often described as the successor to the legendary MiG-31 Foxhound, the MiG-41 is shaping up to be one of the most advanced interceptors ever conceived. With promises of hypersonic speeds, advanced stealth features, and the ability to operate in near-space environments, this aircraft is poised to redefine Russia's aerial defense strategy, the legacy of the MiG-31. To understand the MiG-41, one must first appreciate its predecessor, the MiG-31. Introduced in the late 1970s, the MiG-31 was one of the fastest and most formidable interceptors ever built, capable of speeds exceeding Mach 2.8 and equipped with long-range missiles to defend Russian airspace against high-altitude threats. For decades, it acted as a deterrent against bombers, reconnaissance aircraft, and even potential space-based threats. But as technology advanced, new challenges arose, and Russia needed an aircraft capable of meeting threats of the 21st century. Enter the MiG-41. Why the MiG-41 matters. The global landscape of aerial warfare is changing rapidly. Hypersonic weapons, stealth bombers, and advanced drones pose new challenges to traditional interceptors. The MiG-41 is Russia's answer to these challenges. It is envisioned not just as a faster and stealthier version of the MiG-31, but as a quantum leap forward, an aircraft capable of intercepting hypersonic missiles, engaging targets at extreme altitudes, and operating at speeds few jets have ever achieved. Its role is strategic, to ensure that Russian skies remain secure in an era of unprecedented aerial threats. Hypersonic ambitions. One of the most striking claims about the MiG-41 is its speed. Reports suggest the aircraft could reach speeds up to Mach 4 or even Mach 5, far surpassing current generation fighters. If realized, this would make the MiG-41 one of the fastest manned aircraft ever built. Such speed is not just about bragging rights, it allows the interceptor to cover vast distances quickly, neutralizing threats long before they reach Russian territory. Achieving hypersonic velocity requires revolutionary engines, advanced cooling systems, and materials capable of withstanding extreme temperatures, which makes this project both ambitious and groundbreaking. Advanced Stealth Design While speed is essential, modern warfare also demands stealth. The MiG-41 is expected to integrate a new stealth profile, with reduced radar cross-section and infrared signature. Unlike the MiG-31, which prioritizes speed over invisibility, the MiG-41 aims to combine both. This dual capability allows it to approach targets undetected while retaining the raw velocity to outrun or outmaneuver incoming threats. Its stealth characteristics are particularly crucial in countering modern air defense systems and stealth bombers like the American B-21 radar. Near space capabilities. Another bold feature attributed to the MiG-41 is its potential ability to operate in near space environments. This means flying at altitudes above 20 kilometers, where few aircraft can operate. At such heights, the MiG-41 could potentially target satellites, high-altitude drones, or ballistic missiles. If true, this capability would extend Russia's aerial defense into realms traditionally dominated by space assets. It effectively blurs the line between a high-performance jet and a space plane, making the MiG-41 a unique addition to global military aviation. Cutting-edge avionics At the heart of any modern fighter lies its avionics, and the MiG-41 is expected to feature some of the most advanced systems in Russian aviation history. Reports suggest the use of next-generation radar with extended detection ranges, capable of tracking multiple stealth targets simultaneously. Integration of artificial intelligence could assist pilots in threat assessment, missile targeting, and even semi-autonomous flight. The cockpit will likely feature a digital glass interface, helmet-mounted displays, and systems designed to reduce pilot workload at extreme speeds. Weapon systems. No interceptor is complete without formidable weaponry, and the MiG-41 is expected to push boundaries here as well. Its arsenal may include long-range hypersonic missiles capable of intercepting enemy aircraft and even ballistic or cruise missiles mid-flight. Some sources suggest the possibility of laser-based weapons for missile defense, though these remain speculative. The combination of speed, altitude, and advanced weaponry could make the MiG-41 the ultimate interceptor, designed not just to fight aircraft but to neutralize the entire spectrum of aerial threats. Role in Russia's defense strategy. The MiG-41 fits into Russia's broader defense doctrine as a guardian of its vast airspace. With a landmass stretching across two continents, 
Russia requires aircraft capable of covering enormous distances quickly. The MiG-31 once fulfilled this role, and the MiG-41 is its spiritual and technological successor. Positioned as a long-range interceptor rather than a dogfighter, it complements other Russian aircraft such as the Su-57 stealth fighter, focusing specifically on defense rather than air superiority. Together, these platforms form a multi-layered shield designed to counter both conventional and emerging threats. Comparison with global rivals The MiG-41 is often compared to Western projects such as the US. Next Generation Air Dominance NGA Day Program or the rumored State Route 72 hypersonic aircraft. While NGA Day focuses on versatility, networking, and stealth dominance, the MiG-41 emphasizes raw speed, interception capability, and high-altitude performance. This contrast highlights different philosophies. The US seeks to dominate contested airspace with multi-role flexibility, while Russia prioritizes homeland defense through specialized interceptors. If the MiG-41 delivers on its promises, it may hold unique advantages unmatched by any Western counterpart. Challenges and Uncertainties Despite its bold claims, the MiG-41 faces numerous challenges. Developing engines capable of sustained hypersonic flight is enormously complex, requiring breakthroughs in propulsion and thermal management. Funding is another obstacle. Russia's defense budget is stretched across multiple projects, from the Su-57 to advanced missile systems. Political and economic pressures could slow progress. Additionally, many details about the MiG-41 remain classified, leading to speculation about whether the aircraft will fully meet its ambitious design goals or remain partially conceptual. Technological Innovations What sets the MiG-41 apart is the sheer range of technologies being considered. From plasma stealth cloaking systems that could deflect radar waves, to advanced composite materials resistant to hypersonic heat, to AI-assisted piloting systems, the jet embodies futuristic innovation. Even if all these technologies are not realized in the initial version, the project acts as a testbed for concepts that could shape future Russian aerospace design. The MiG-41 is as much about pushing boundaries as it is about building a practical aircraft. Potential Service Timeline According to reports, the MiG-41 is projected to enter service around 2026, though this timeline may be optimistic given the complexity of its development. Initial prototypes and demonstrators are likely to appear first, followed by a gradual integration into the Russian Aerospace Forces. If successful, the MiG-41 could remain in service well into the mid-21st century, potentially forming the backbone of Russia's interceptor fleet for decades. Strategic Impact The arrival of the MiG-41 has implications beyond Russia. It signals a new era of competition in high-speed, high-altitude aviation. For NATO and other global powers, it introduces a platform that could challenge existing assumptions about air defense and space security. It may also trigger renewed interest in hypersonic aircraft projects elsewhere, accelerating the global arms race in aerospace technology. The MiG-41 is not just a fighter jet, it is a statement of intent from Russia to remain a leader in advanced military aviation. Cultural and Symbolic Value Beyond its technical aspects, the MiG-41 carries symbolic weight. Like the MiG-25 and MiG-31 before it, it represents Russia's determination to defend its airspace at all costs. It embodies the engineering culture of pushing machines to their physical limits, a tradition deeply rooted in Soviet and Russian aviation history. For enthusiasts and defense analysts alike, the MiG-41 is a reminder that the age of experimental, daring interceptors is far from over. Limitations Of course, the MiG-41 will not be without limitations. Its extreme specialization as an interceptor may make it less flexible than multi-role fighters. High costs could limit production numbers, reducing its overall impact compared to more versatile aircraft. Its effectiveness will also depend on integration with Russia's broader defense network, including satellites, radar systems, and missile forces. Nonetheless, its unique capabilities could ensure it plays a critical 